Good morning guys, Ashantin here. I thought it would be nice to do a, a little bit of exploring and what I want to do is I found an area over here which has some very big trees in. So if we head west, just due west, and let's go and swim a bit. That's it. I just want to go due west because if I keep going through these valleys, um, through here, ah, collect food as we go. That's nice. Good. And is that flint? It's not, it's shale. Okay, I thought I got all the flint up anyway. Some of these crops are growing. I'm not sure whether they will ever reach maturity, but we can keep an eye on them. This area is going to be very useful to me. Oh, hello, hog. Let's ignore you for the time being because it's got fire. Good grief. It's got far clay in it. <laughs> I've been down here quite a bit, actually, um, rampaging around. Let me get a sword in my hand. Um, but I'm, I'm thinking of actually just you know, clearing away. You can say I've cleared some of the way. But I want to get quite a straight line through here. Possibly not through the tree trunks. But it will be helpful to... I, I, was, I swear this jungle's growing. Now through here... Here we go. Yeah. There's another hog there. I ought to come hunting over here. I really should. There's some beautiful trees. I don't know what I wanted that for. And what I want to do is to have a look at these big trees. I'm not sure when they generated, but I do want to check them. I saw this line of great trees here, and I thought that they needed checking for bees, bee skips. I'm not sure whether they're too close to where I am. Guys, I'll be back in a minute. Hi guys, <laughs> I am moving on. I had uh, to go and answer the door. We've taken in a package for a neighbor. So I just want to come over here again because what I'm looking for are these trees. <gasps> Look at this guys. I'm listening out to see whether I can hear any bees or anything like that. I can't hear any. I wonder whether I would hear them or just feel them if they started to sting me. I'm looking at these big trees which are absolutely stunning guys, totally stunning. I mean, are they growing? Did they spawn like that? They're so immense, aren't they? beautiful beautiful trees but i can't see any bees there now this one i have great hopes for these are a bit further from home they may have spawned in after the i updated look at these trees guys it's all to keep saying look at these trees look at these trees but just sometimes you know you do get lost in the beauty of what's going on around you what about this one anything it's awful to f gosh look at them i keep mistaking though these little bits of particles floating around and i keep thinking that they might just be bees i'm not sure whether there's any height limit on where bees spawn let's go up again this looks to me like the sort of trees where you would find beehives and bee nests. But it might be just any tree. And while we're here, guys, let's try to get some more bamboo shoots. Because this is way outside our area. Those are chickens. Let's try and get some more bamboo shoots. Let's see if I can get a few, because um, they do actually give off. Um, oops. 
they should be able to give off um, saplings. What's holding me back here? There's something stopping me going up there. I can't see what it is. That's really weird. Maybe it's the tree itself. See, I'm not getting... No, I've not got any shoots here. Hmm. Yeah. And it's really the... It's really the actual... I mean, I'll take these down anyway. Now that I've taken the leaves off them. But it's really... I'm not... I'm really looking for bamboo saplings more than I'm looking for the shoots. I'm also keeping an eye open for bees as well. I don't... I can't see them doing in a tree like this. Oh, come on. Give me some shoots. Let's, um... Let's pillar up. Oh, hang on. Before I do that... Before I do that, let me eat something. I'll get rid of that rock in a minute. Wow, that doesn't go very far, does it? Let's eat that as well. Hmm. Okay. Oops. Let's pull it up here. I'm carrying earth with me in case I get surprised by wolves. Um, but I've decided to keep going out and exploring a bit more just to get what I want out of this game because otherwise I'm going to be locked into my house just sort of spending the entire time killing wolves which is somewhat boring. It's not boring killing them. Oh, I see these are actually... Mm, it's, but it, what is boring is waiting for them to come to me. But I have now, ah, oh, I've got a sapling. I've got a sapling. Two saplings. Excellent. Let's just pop that. If I can, can I pop that down? Yeah. Right, let's take these with us. Make some more bamboo, um... Oh, good, it took both of them down. Bamboo planks, which I like very much. That's... I don't want the vines. Not doing... Will those stack? They will. Only to 32. Okay, better than nothing. That's... Oh, look at this. Mature onions growing onions. Good, we've got another seed. I would love to get some of these hens over in my area. We are looking for bees. That's a hog. The back side of a hog. It is not a wolf. Right, let's see if there's any bees over here. Hmm, this looks promising, doesn't it, guys? A large tree... In real life, a large tree protected by the mountains and the rocks would be a prime site for bees. I hope I'm looking in the right place here. I hope I'm not meant to be looking on the lower trees. Lovely area. It's all so beautiful. Oh, oh, oh. Never want to refuse free copper. I did actually get caught out here after dark. nice yeah a little bit of copper and I managed to go through a mountain oh goodness what an open lake area isn't that beautiful I don't know if I can do anything with these apparently not we've got more saplings more bamboo here I'm going to see if I can get some more of these saplings is that a crevasse Oh, guys, look at the copper down there. That's easily accessible copper too. And fire clay. Nice. Nice. That copper's quite near to this. 
Oh my goodness. Where's the sun? I think it's just over there. Um, if we look down here. Yeah, there was a lot of copper just here. I just happened to have... Oh! What was that? Oh, crikey! Uh. Is it still chasing me? Oh, God. I do not want to die here to a flipping locust. Right, let's get my head above water. Swim, girl, swim. Goodness. Crikey. Look, come on, get out, get out, get out. I can't get out of this water. Can I not jump up? Right. Oh my goodness. Right. Okay, I have a base near her. I'm not sure where. We may have to spend the night up on Earth if I can't find it. Oh gosh, the drifter's out already. Oh my lord. Right, guys. Let's close that down. Well, that looks like being a long night. <laughs> oh, foolish girl. <laughs> what was it I said? This looks easily accessible copper. <laughs> I couldn't work out what was killing me. Okay, bye-bye, guys. See you in the morning. Perhaps. <laughs> Well guys, one of the drifters gone. There's some more down at the bottom. Ah, oh, good, another one's gone off. He's, yeah, you go. That just leaves me with one. Oh, are you coming back? Wow, there's a lot of them. They seem to be going away. It's apart from you, you persistent little devil. Is that it? Good. Thank you, guys. Well, that was a miserable night. Stuck up on top of a pile of earth. <laughs> I must say, the cockles are absolutely wonderful here. I love them. Let's just have a look at these trees again. I've decided to come back later to get that copper. And I'm not carrying so much stuff with me. I've got stuff with me at the moment. Now, I need to go east to get back home. I hope. There's our twin pigs there. Let's run a little bit. Is this the way home, I wonder? If it's not, it doesn't matter. We'll just turn around and go the other way after we've gone this way for a day or two and got nowhere. That's it. Let's do this with twigs. Let's not use up our implements. Yep. Come down here. Downhill and up Dale. It's very pretty. It's getting more and more overgrown, though. I'm convinced these forests are actually expanding and growing and getting thicker. Guys, look, at the top of there, oh, this is where my temporary house is, somewhere around here. Oh. Looky here. Have I got enough? I'm not sure. Whoops, whether my um, axe would last get me up there but if it would I would love to take I may end up taking this whole thing down yeah look at this guys 
This is copper just for the taking. And my whole landscape is going to look mothy in here. And yeah, we've got more up here, haven't we? Which, whoops, which way does it go? Gosh, these are copper mountains indeed. It's up there. I just happen to have some ladders with me. <laughs> Let's put that instead of the flint. Okay. All right. They seemed like a good thing to bring with us. Oh, nice, guys. Nice. Look at this. Copper mountains indeed. You know, I used to watch Etho playing um, Terra Firma Craft. And I do remember how much Etho always, even in Minecraft, if he wanted stuff, he would always use ladders. And ladders were just so important to him. I tell you what, ladders are becoming so important to me too. Oh, nice, nice, nice. taking this mountain down guys. I'm not sure I should destroy the landscape like this. But my need is great. Did I get that bit? I did. And this is low fertility soil. That's fine. I just didn't want to miss the opportunity. Okay. Now, is there more up there? can't see it. No. I think we've got the best of it. So I'm going, I don't know if I can stand here. Oh. Oops, yes. Possibly not. Let's take our ladders with us. Wow. Look at that. 22 copper and a maple sapling and um i got i got trapped yeah well, we we know where you are now you were up there you're probably down below as well this is a copper rich area i have to say guys i don't think i would have been am i going east i am i don't think i would have been able look at that wow these are copper mountains indeed, but I'm going to take this loose copper anyway. I mean, frankly, I could think, reckon I could dig down anywhere here and find copper or dig up. And digging up is much, it's much more attractive than those horrible little things that keep attacking me under the ground. Locusts, yeah. Not a great fan of those. If they dropped something, it'd be worth it. And the drifters too. Yeah, there's our spawn area. Oh my goodness. I hadn't seen I've got copper so close to home just there. Look at that. Huh. Well, well, well. Just shows you have to look, doesn't it? I think I, I normally come just a bit to the right. Mm. Can't you can dig up here, Ash. In fact, you could do it if you used a shovel. What's up there? Just checking, I'm not... Yeah. Nice lot of animals. I am short of food. I shall come out here. But I have to say that catching up with chickens is not my favourite pastime. They don't half run quickly. Here we go. There's no use collecting anymore. I haven't got the inventory space. This is so nice here. Yeah, I struck so, so lucky when I got this spawn, I really did. Yep, yeah, you're empty. I'll leave, I'm not taking all the bushes. I just have a feeling that one day I might be desperate for food and they wouldn't be there. This is not looking good yet, but it's looking like home. So as opposed to a pile of mud, it's not looking too bad at all. Oh wow, I can feel the breaststroke there. 
Yep. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Well, I think that, uh, well, we didn't find bees, but we found another onion seed, a load of copper, three bamboo saplings. Not bad going, guys, for a little day's exploring. Um, I'm just wondering how far people normally have to go to find bees. I have a horrible feeling it might be a long way. Right, and I need to get, I've just got a whole load of, um, oh, charcoal completed. I'm building a path out to those ruins. If I ever find bees, that's going to be where I keep my flowers and my bees, I think. So I could start actually loading that up now, but I don't want to. Right, let's go down and plant these bamboo saplings before I get any further with this. That's it. Uh, and just in case I get killed, let's... We're doing well on the copper, actually. Let's get you in there. I think the rest of that can come with me. I keep hearing ducks. Okay, let's go and look at our traps. We now have traps over here. I do love these paths. I absolutely love these paths. Have we caught anything? We had one solitary chicken, which has now grown up and that's it. But I think over here, oh, great, we've caught a hog and a baby. That's fantastic. Our food supplies are increasing. Our food supplies are increasing. And those are our bamboo saplings. And I'm waiting to see whether I can form a fence out of bamboo. Can I get through there? I can't. Now, am I right, I wonder, in assuming that if I can't get through uh, a space, then nothing else can? I wonder if that is a fair assumption. Hmm. Be nice to think so, wouldn't it? Yeah. And I reckon that out here, oh, let's just skirt around the pigs. The boars, they're boars, they're wild boars. Uh, I don't want to uh, do it, but this thing, it's, in fact, while I'm here, um, yeah, I think it's just the right size because we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So if I take up those three, I think that's right. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, eight that's it nine ah so the edge would come there i was just a little bit short wasn't i guys let's take those two up because i think you need that's it yeah a nine by nine for this yeah the arch is lovely but I think I'm going to reuse the stone to make it into a little stone encampment so that uh, if I get a beehive, I can put it in there. Is that... It's still not growing. I think I'm going to have to make a bucket and actually... Oops. Here we go. Yeah, I'm all these plans for having bees, but... Uh, I think I'm going to have to have some sort of strategy for finding them because I'm, I don't know how much long it would take to find them. Okay, guys, I'll leave it at that for tonight. Bye-bye. See you next episode.